sucking up. Today I'm currently on my way towards Powerhouse Gym. It is currently 10.30 in the morning. Meeting up with Shulk. We are going to do a full session together today. Let's run down. What are we doing? So we're gonna do a back workout mainly for thickness. So we're gonna start with high rows, then we're gonna go into seated rows. We're doing a bunch of rows today. A little bit for width, but mainly for thickness. That targets your upper flat. Yeah, I realized I'm, I'm bringing so my elbows out as much as I can. I, I, the way he was gripping it, he was gripping it for his middle. Instead of tucking my elbows in, yeah. I'm flaring them out as much as I can so and keeping them a little higher so they're hitting my upper lat. I'll probably lower my elbow down just because I'm going to focus more on the lower lat here. I'm trying to build that lower lat up. See my, my grip and elbow? I'm a little more focused on the lower back versus Shulk was going up here. Just because my lower back is slacking, so I gotta bring that up. Grab the upper when you do it. What's a what's a cool Russian word you could give for the viewers? Sukabiat. Russian curse words. Uh, There's like a really cool handle that we can use for straight arm lat pull downs. You wanna literally just focus on the lat. I notice a lot of people when they do it, they tense up their tricep. I mean it sometimes happens, but like when you're coming down, don't flex the tricep, keep the arms. Oh uh, yeah, you last time I tried doing this with you, you're like, why are you doing tricep push downs? Yeah. And that wasn't. No triceps here, uh, only yeah. lat activation. Psyched me out. I had to fight that. Like mentally, I was just like, I can't, I can't stop right now. <laughs> Hey, what is going on guys? So, we got a haircut. Hey, but we are two days out. Today is uh, Thursday. We are two days out from our show. It's currently uh, 11 a.m. I woke up a little later today. Wanted to get more rest. Rest is the most important during prep. And uh, that's what I lacked a lot last year. Today is our last training and cardio session. Overall, today is a load up day in terms of water. We're supposed to drink three gallons. So, let's do it. Apparently we got a quick check and I have to get three gallons and drink three gallons so it should be fun. I gotta finish this and I gotta finish those. Three gallons! Uh, just 
finished up last cardio session of this prep. The second gallon right now, eight o'clock. We are done with the second gallon. We have one more gallon to go. We are at Powerhouse. It's kind of far, you guys can't really see. But last training session on prep, I'm gonna show you guys a little pump up and my physique. Let's get into it. I feel on top of this world. Like I feel crazy. I don't know if that's because of the difference in change from last year to this year and seeing that significant difference in my back and in my in my in my posing. It's just making me like feel feel very much where I should be at, but I can't stay comfortable. And that's why I spend almost two hours posing every single day in total and that's what I've been doing for the past week and a half now and I have a fucked up hip too that's the worst part about it because I got injured and we're just pushing through this you know we got we got tomorrow left and tomorrow after tomorrow we got Saturday that's when it's game time so I'm excited and I just gotta push through this right now by the way this hoodie is by Wolf Gym, code Unis 10. I'll see you guys. I'm gonna change just a second. Okay. Change just a little bit. I'm looking like a freaking sitcom, bro. Now you look great, I don't think the camera's not even doing it justice either. Like a freaking sitcom, bro. Look at the titty bounce, titty bounce. You got to call me at home, right? Yes, bro. Yo, bro. Right. Bro, I'm gonna fucking fly. I'm Let me flying. Let's hit it back double for the culture. Open up, just go. Yo, PK. Peace, buddy.
bro. Little does he know. One scoop of I'll protein. Be, I'll be seeing him sooner than he knows. Little does he know. <laughs> Yo, bro. Bro. One scoop of protein with 55 grams of oats. You should be thankful. I want steak. <laughs> he didn't have to give I you I want that. donuts. He didn't have to give you that scoop I of protein. <laughs> Guys, but like bodybuilding, on a real note, it's not as healthy as you think it is. You get very hungry, you make sacrifices, it fucks with your mental health. Not a lot of people know about this, it does. And you have to understand your body in that term. You have to really like understand and self-reflect certain things. Um, if you ever want to do this sport, right, and if you look at my videos, and if you want to truly take on bodybuilding as a sport rather than just the lifestyle, fit lifestyle, um, there's a lot of sacrifices. You sacrifice friends, you sacrifice fun time with people, you sacrifice sometimes even relationships, and even family sometimes. But you gotta do what you gotta do. At the end of the day, if you have a goal, and you have something that you want to get at and you really dream of, you gotta do whatever it takes. So sometimes you gotta make those sacrifices. Friday, <laughs> Friday, November 11, 8 o'clock. We gotta go get BK, Coach BK from the airport. So um, this should be fun. Oh my God! Different, <laughs> different, <laughs> different. Very different, right? take you guys on a little tour it's Friday Friday night we're just gonna stay in here for Friday night um, I'm also staying with two other competitors these are my coaches uh, athletes so my coach BK he's coaching these two teenagers as well and they're also gonna stay with us so we got an Airbnb all together good little bond speaking of that what's, what's up, up baby Team BK in the motherfucking house yes sir right, your boys gotta take a shit We got the kitchen set up right here, stove, microwave, fridge, all the things we need. We got the couch, TV, and then you walk through here, we got bedroom number one, bedroom number two. So what's your name, bro? Brian. Brian, are you excited? Yeah. Because you're also competing. Yeah. So what are you doing, classic or men's physique? I'm doing both. You're doing both? Yeah. Uh, he said I got legs. How old are you? 18. 18. We got a we got a youngster right here. I remember when I was 18. I had just started like yeah, basically nice lifting when I was 18. So you're competing when you're 18. That's a huge respect, bro. Yeah. My first competition was when I was 23. No, 23. You're 23? Yeah, I'm 24. Oh, Damn, she's so slim. Sheesh. Wait till I shave. I gotta. I've got the, this clutch. This Phillips, right here, bro. Phillips Saint Croix Morocco. <laughs> BK missed a shit ton of hair on his back. Wait, yeah, I, I told him the mystery is. Yeah, that's a pretty sick shot. Alright, let me shave and come back. Jeez! Bro, we can play pool now. Is it pool? I'll sauce you in pool. <laughs> I'm down. I'm down. Currently four o'clock. We're gonna go tanning in about an hour. Get the nice juicy first coat. And I kind of miss how I look on t with that tan, yo. I'll show you guys exactly how I look right when we get back from tanning. I'll see you. <laughs>
That's like, you gotta keep that shirt forever now. I hope you know that. Wolf That's Jim. like a special shirt. Wolf Jim, Co. Eunice Ted. Oh, it is? Oh, Wolf all right. Jim. Oh, I fucks with that. There we go. Wolf Jim, baby. Oh, you are, dude. Yeah. Oh, look, this one is okay. <clears throat> oh, all right. I'm liking what I'm seeing, Turkish Tank. I like what I'm seeing through today. I'm really liking what I'm seeing. That's exactly what we needed. Oh. Currently 7.56 in the morning. I got decent sleep, just kidding. I only got like fucking three hours. Let's do it. <laughs> we sleep when we die. There you go. Damn. Bronzed out overnight. Go hit a couple. Hit a couple songs. <laughs> I just got out of bed. Fucking body is hard. It's my face work stresses. I'm only sure I'm looking at the stage with no stupid ass. That's a fucking big. What is that? Coffee. Black, black coffee. Black coffee. That's a fucking massive black coffee. It's large. And he like, wants like you to finish that. that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. A couple hours away from show. It's currently 9 a.m. Woo! I feel good. I feel great. I'm ready to fucking rock, bro. And like. One valuable lesson I've learned in my life is with patience comes guidance and with patience comes success. So remember to constantly work hard in your craft and be patient while you do it and enjoy the process. And this is the point where I'm enjoying every little moment of it because these are the years that will fly by and these are the years that I will always remember. You want something? You get it! You can do it! Let's go!
Yeah, man. So it was a good battle. Placing wise, I did not get the center like I wanted to, but it was a good competition. I was like second, I guess. But we're going to finals now. <laughs> yeah, go to finals now. I'm pretty calm. Nice. Top two, top two. You gotta show your video. Show your I video. love you, Sitcom. Thank you, man. Thank you. What does that mean? Sitcom? You don't know what a sitcom is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. let me get the definition of a. Uh, uh. Come on, bro. I'm a fucking sitcom, bro. Look. I'm sorry. Look. It's, it's like a thing from 2004. Come on, bro. Oh. What is it? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Still do well, still do well, still do well. Hey, 100%. Whoa! <laughs> Dude wasted no time. That looks good. Yo! What? We're spot fucking short. But you know what it is? We're fine. He's gonna get better, and as our track record shows, he gets better every fucking time. We get better every fucking time. So, yeah, just watch out. We're here next year. We got the skull. We got third, but we did fucking great. That's all yeah, that matters. Yeah. We did great. Yeah.